Hello, and welcome to Fish Talk. I am your friend and loyal companion, Phil. This episode, I would like to address viewer mail. Because without you, my fans and compatriots and you know, people I pass on the street, you're all very important to me. So I figured I would address you and read some letters from you. So I can answer any questions about myself that you might be curious about besides fish. Before I start, do you notice anything different? Give you a hint. I, I made it with a marker. Did you guess yet? Okay. Um, it's it's a t-shirt. Can't if you look at it closely. It's got three symbols on it. And can you guess what it says? I believe they call it anagram. I heart, which is love, Leonard Fishburne, or any goldfish. It could be your goldfish or anybody, but the fact of the matter remains is that I love fish. Goldfish and koi especially. So without further ado, I will get to the viewer mail. Have it. I'm fairly excited about this. Dear fuck Phil. Uh, just Phil. There's no F word before Phil, it's just a Phil. <laughs> Man. Why do you start the beginning of the show with a different voice and then progressively talk like a normal person or what would be a normal person? You're an asshole. Love. Mm, Big Johnson. It might be just M. Big Johnson. Well, M. Big Johnson, uh, you know, the beginning I like to have a serious voice. So I'll be like, hello and welcome to Fish Talk, or something like that. And it, it can vary. But you have to take it serious because, you know, this is serious business fish ownership. And the more you don't take it serious, the more you write nasty letters. So if that answers your question, Big Johnson, I hope you have a nice day. And sometimes I'll even do a British voice. And um, sometimes I just get comfortable. I mean, I'm no movie star. Shit, duh. I'm just a fish owner. Just a normal fish guy. Okay. Dear Phil. Sorry. Dear Phil. You are an erratic mess and you need to get it together or you will always be with your fish alone and hopefully dead and I hope your fish die too. Fuck you, Jack. Well, these aren't as nice as I was hoping they would be. Um, Jack. I don't ever want to, I'm, I'm sorry if I, I know in the last episode I lost it a little bit and uh, got a little emotional just because I love fish so much. I mean, Lawrence Fishburne was trying to kill Leo McCoy. And if that doesn't make you mad or upset or want to throw up, now I'll know what will. So, Jack, I'm sorry. I, I try to be a man. My father always said I wasn't a man. He never, really, ever, he never 
You never show me love. You just wanted to take me fishing. And I said, Daddy, I don't want to kill fish, Daddy. I mean, they're just so pretty. Why would I kill a fish? And he would just cuddle me up in and start eating them. I mean, he would even eat them raw in front of me just to tease me. And, you know, how does anyone get over that? Thank you, Jack. Okay. I don't know how many more of these I can read. So, bear with me. Dear Phil, I find your show very interesting and has helped me along the way to be a responsible owner of a goldfish. And my goldfish's name is Abraham. Hi, Abraham. It's a good name. After watching your show and taking your advice, my beloved Abraham died. So thanks to you, asshole. I flushed my best friend down the toilet. I hope you rot. Lisa. Well, well Lisa, I don't know what to say. Maybe, maybe I'm not mentally correct. Maybe I'm bipolar. Maybe, maybe I shouldn't be showing people how to live their lives through fish. But I just wanted to make people happy. That's all I ever wanted to do. I'm not feeling too good. Well, if anybody there likes me or loves me, just try to send nice letters next time. And I, don't, I don't know if I want to do this again, but just send me a nice letter. So, Big Johnson and Jack and Lisa, and I'm not an asshole. Well, thank you for joining me. This has been a very terrible episode of Fish Talk. Next time you will meet my guest, the mayor. Bye.